Welcome back to my seven days of seven days to die series. I believe this is day four, which means we have a lot of work to do and a lot of prep before night seven. Let's get into it. Okay, we are back. Uh, okay, <laughs> hold on. Let me pause. What I'm going to do is I'm going to start ravaging these houses, get as much stuff as I possibly can because it is day four. I think on day five and maybe six, I will start to chop down these trees and then start making spikes to protect the house. I also need to work on cobblestoning the outer layer of my defenses and maybe even a roof that I can stand on to shoot the zombies. But we also need to go pick up that airdrop as well. Where is that airdrop? I swear there was an airdrop last episode. Let me go look at the previous episode so I know where the airdrop is. <laughs> Welcome back to my seven days of seven days that I series. It's good to be this here. Is go through okay, it looks like it was northwest-ish. So yes, yeah, somewhere off in this direction, but I feel like it's gone now. Do airdrops despawn? I don't think they do. Hello? Any zombies? Okay, good medical supplies. Very nice. I like, I like. Ooh, nice rotting flesh. <laughs> Very good. Okay, nothing. Okay, we are seriously good on food for a while. I think we're going to make it to day 7. <laughs> now, the zombies on night 7 are going to be running at me. Sprinting at me. So I need to be prepared. So I don't know if, like, my 200 9mm bullets are going to do it. Or if I'm going to need something else. Another death safe? Do I have any lockpicks? I do have 5. Here we go. Come on. Damn it! But none left. <laughs> That's a shame. Eh, it's almost picked. Oh, I'm sorry, buddy. Oh! <laughs> I'm so sorry. That was such a bad way to go. It's all been looted already. These haven't. Okay, what is that? Motor tool small tank mod. Wow, thanks. I can use that in like three weeks when I finally get motor tools. Was that an anvil? Oh, I also need to kill animals as well for leather so I can make a forge during the night. I need to remember that. Ooh. Maybe the trader has leather. Okay, I need 10 leather, I think. Okay, so let's check the trader. Oh, he's not open yet, is he? I haven't heard him. Nope, oh, he's open. <laughs> the name's Jenny, but you can call me Dr. Jen. Hi, Jenny. Or Dr. Jen, I guess. Uh, leather. 66. I don't think I have any money, but I need 7. So I need $462. I mean, 21 bucks, but the gold nuggets and the silver nuggets are probably worth something. Sell price is 980. Okay, let's sell these silver nuggets and we'll buy the leather we need to make the forge. Oh wait, I need to sell the silver nuggets first. 50! Oh, 50 each. Let's just buy all nine just in case. And we'll keep no, nine no, silver nuggets, deal. just in case. Right. We have enough leather. I will make the forge. What do I need to make a forge? Small stone, clay soil, leather, duct tape, short iron pipes. Yeah, we've got plenty. So I will make that... I should probably make it now, honestly. A forge. Now, let's chuck the forge here. Okay, now, the way we do forging in this game is we grab the raw ingredients... And then we chuck them into the forge, and then we mil we make stuff in the forge. Now, I know that doesn't really make any sense, but let me show you. So, iron goes here. I need the wood to turn it on. Hold on. Uh, that'll do. So, we turn it on, and now it starts smelting everything. Now, you'll see it starts ticking up on the right. That means that we have that ingredient ready in the forge to use. I'll just keep them there for now. 
Now what I need to make is forged iron, so iron and clay. So we probably just need to do the clay first. We need a lot more iron to make forged iron. Which is annoying. So, now that that is going, that'll take a quite a while to go through. Okay, now, the airdrop is gone. I don't really know where that is. Uh, I don't need leather anymore, so I just need to get maybe wood? No, I think I need to start... I need to keep raiding the houses around us. Just so I have enough stuff. <laughs> so I don't need to do it on day 5, 6, and 7. Maybe 5, I can, maybe I can do it on day 5 again. But I want the last couple of days to just be in preparation of... Day 7. Holy cow, I will take that. Whew. Hell yes. Sledgehammer. Okay, wood. Uh, that's fantastic. Mechanical parts. Don't really need that yet, but I'll take it. Let's take a look at this house first. You're still alive. Oh, not for long. <laughs> I don't need cement, do I? What's down here? Ammunitions box. Oh, good eyes, Ben. Good eyes. Hello. Oh, that was lucky. She almost got a hit in. She did not get a hit in. Wow, this thing is good. Uh, you can sort of see the difference in the wood on the floor. That's how I knew. There was something there. Actually, yeah, I should be picking up all these chairs and disassembling them for wood. Yeah, if I scrap, I get wood out of it. So that's just free wood. Oh, okay, I'll take it. A stone spear, scrap boots, which I'll wear. Uh, scrap you, scrap the brass doorknob, and take the rest. Nice, thank you. A wooden crate? A pipe rifle? Oh my god. I'm set, boys. I'm set for night seven. That's all I wanted, is just like another type of gun. So now I can use both the... Both the types of ammo I've been given. It's 9mm and 7.62 ammo. Okay. You're dead. <laughs> Thanks for showing up. Oh, airdrop. How far away is it? Okay, I'm getting that. Let's get this zombie and then we might drop all our stuff and get that airdrop. Hello, zombie. Goodbye, zombie. <laughs> Hi, buddy. How you doing? That's alright, I'll put you down. There you go. This sledgehammer is insane. <laughs> I can just one-hit zombies now. I mean, now I got a buttload of stuff. Well, I, I do have a pipe machine gun. Hmm. Huh. I'm actually not worried at all. I feel like we're very, very set. For, uh, for night seven. Tonight, I will look at all the modifications I have and see what I can do. Steroids. Holy cow. Can't wait to take that on night 7. Just chuck you in. And then actually, can you make me forged iron? How many can you make? 68. I only need 20 for now. So make me 20. Cool. See you later. Uh, I want 20 because I want to be able to upgrade both of my doors. Oh, hey buddy. Bye buddy. <laughs> oh, there's a giant chasm here as well. Why did they drop in the same spot as last time? Okay, give me something good. Please. I mean, 500 wooden cubes I'll take. Because I can deconstruct those into wood. And I can actually use the wood. Now, I was thinking on the way over that most likely the airdrop hasn't despawned. But I've just lost the icon for it. So, it's probably still there. I just don't exactly know where it is. Which is sort of the same as it not being there in the first place. Because I have just no idea where to go. Oh, hey, buddy. Bye, buddy. 
<laughs> I've done that so much this episode. I love this thing. Uh oh. I've been here before. Okay, we actually get wood so much faster now. This is good. It's real good. Not yet. That's good. You haven't started yet. Dump you. Dump you. Dump you. Okay. Now, I'm probably just going to scrap these, because these are just straight up wood. You've made me 20. Fantastic. Let's make two doors. Uh, iron door. Two of them. Fantastic. And then we'll use the other 20 iron that we have. Here it is. To make a pickaxe. Uh, axe. Iron pickaxe. 50 forged iron. Okay, never mind. That can stay right there. Okay, so now the inner, the inner circle is all cobblestone. I'll fix those corners there, don't worry. The outside edges are cobblestone. Okay. Good to know. Yeah, I'm just going to scrap. The, where did they go? Oh, they went to the queue. Okay, it just disappeared and I was so confused. Okay, let's upgrade this first. Iron door, very good. Now I need steel to upgrade it further. Sorry, iron to upgrade it further. Okay. Now how many forged iron can I make? Can I make 50? I'll make 40. That'll use all my iron. <laughs> now I've got 840 there. Okay, let's just craft that so I can get a pickaxe. So I can start upgrading. I can start getting more rocks. Hello. Sorry, dude. Goodbye, dude. Okay, 8 o'clock. Now, I don't want to set up the spikes, like, a few nights early, because then I'm just going to maybe waste them on zombies that are watering too close. So I'm going to save it until day 7, then I'll set up all of the spikes that I need. Okay, second upgrade. There we go. Perfect. How strong are you? 2,500. That will last quite a while. Especially if I just have forged iron just ready. <laughs> oh, 40. Fantastic. Uh, axe. Iron pickaxe. I need wood, leather, duct tape. Don't tell me I've only... Okay, good. I've got enough leather. Uh, duct tape. Fantastic. Iron pickaxe. I need 50 forged iron. The other 10 is there. That's... I planned that. Iron pickaxe. Add it to the, the queue. 10 available points. Holy cow. Okay. My immediate thought is Vine 69 or a mother load. Just so I can... Uh, headshot bonus and dismemberment chance with shotguns, clubs, sledgehammers, and tools. I mean, I could just go... I can get double the amount of resources so I just don't die on day 7. I feel like that's probably just the best idea, right? I can't buy you yet, can I? Okay, max them both out with all, with my 10 points. Now I get double the amount of resources from everything. And next up, we need two minutes left on you. That's fine. Holy cow, is that a horde? There's like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven zombies over there. I probably just need to lay low. Okay, 4,000 wood. So, now we start making uh, spikes. Sorry about the noise. We can make 235. I think we'll start off by making 100, which does take 2,000 wood. But we'll see how much 100 gets us. I assume it's going to be a pretty decent amount, but we'll, we'll find out. Are they firing on us? They are. They are, they're breaking down the wall. Not that, please. Thank you.
Not good. Not good. Not good at all. I broke it. That wasn't the last bullet as well. <sighs> that was nerve wracking. It's going to be a whole night of that. Thank God I've got really good ears because I could barely hear that. You've done about a hundred damage to each block. Ugh, that's so annoying. <laughs> I mean, the spikes will definitely slow them down as well, so we need to take that into account. Okay, so it is almost 4 a.m. So that means day six, day five is upon us. I have almost filled out all of the wood all the way around. I'll do that. I'll finish that next night. We have a bunch of wood that we're using to create spikes now. Sorry about the noise. It's all the cobblestone rocks we're making. We've upgraded both our doors to iron doors. We are set. We have a forge. I think things are looking extremely up, extremely on the positive side. We should be good to go for day seven. I will see you guys in the next episode. Thank you so much for watching. Peace. Good. I don't know. I know it's After Effects. Done through After Effects. That's why I'm like, ugh. What have we got there? Okay, but what the hell is that? Is that vodka? That's... L How much is a, a bottle of vodka in standard drinks? I want to say it's like 10. Probably more.